Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. Today, I am super excited. We are taking a look at Thor's newest brand of Super C. Super exciting and nice. This is the bath and a half floor plan. And I believe after this year, you will see that this is one of the top selling Super C's on the entire planet. This is the 2023 Thor Pasadena model 38MX. World debut for Matt's RV reviews. We are gonna take a look at the outside features first, then the inside features. Then we're gonna give you three things you love about this motorhome and three things we dislike about it. We're starting in three, two, one. Welcome back to another video again today. I am super excited to be doing the world debut of the Thor Pasadena Very exciting before I begin got to say hi to Andrea. Hey, Andrea hey everyone. How's it going today? It's going good real quick you guys I just want to give a thanks to everybody that came to see us at the Hershey RV show. Yes We really enjoy it you guys you don't know how much we look forward to that. So thank you. Yes, and also shout out to Pasadena, Maryland What's up Pasadena, Maryland? We're looking at the Pasadena Motorhome. I actually grew up in Pasadena Andrea, we're from <laughs> Pasadena. Shout out Pasadena, Maryland. And Pasadena, Maryland has the most talented RV people in the industry. Matt's RV reviews came from Pasadena. Uh, Mike and Susan, the RV bloggers yes. from Pasadena. Bob, my old GM from Leo's Vacation Center from Pasadena. Shout out to everybody from Pasadena. Andrea, I'm super excited. You know, there's so much talent from Pasadena. <laughs> Thor just had to name this after yes. Pasadena. Andrea, let's begin. Model is Thor Pasadena 38MX. The actual tip tip length is 39 feet 4 inches. This is the Thor Pasadena. It is their new Super C made on an S2 RV chassis. What's very exciting is they have two of them sister products. The Thor Inception that we, um, that we did the video on a few weeks ago. And now this Thor Pasadena. Now this is direct competition to the Seneca and Accolade. So it has the 6.7 ISB engine, 360 horsepower, 800 pound feet of torque. And Andrea, this is built on the S2 RV chassis, which is the chassis made from Freightliner that's great for RVers. It's the lower profile one, very easy. And then we look at this. And then look, for the average RVer, you don't need a super monster truck. You know, you're able to check your oil, do all your maintenance right here. And Andrea, this is in America. Do you know what this is? What's that? Pasadena. Pasadena. Heck yeah. <laughs> Andrea, you know what I will say? I miss Pasadena, but I don't miss the Pasadena weather. I agree. It's a lot better in Florida. <laughs> We're Floridians now, Matt. <laughs> and then look at these tires, Andrea. They're the Bridgestones. I love those. 295-75 R22.5 with the shiny AccuRide rims. Andrea, do you think you think Thor's gonna come out with a new motorhome now called the Lando Lakes? I think that's too long, but <laughs> right here we do have trucker style mirrors. Could chrome be the mirrors. Tampa. The Tampa, yeah. Chrome mirrors right here. Very nice. Now look at this. this look at this. Nice. Running boards to get up. Heck yeah. You're climbing in, Andrea. This is gonna be a great ride. Air ride, suspension and everything. You got power windows. And Andre, when you're sitting in this beast, people are getting out of your way. Matt, do you know why? You are just so excited about Super C's. I love Super C's, but do you know why everybody's gonna get out your way? Because it's the Pasadena. Hey. <laughs> All right. Cargo carrying capacity, 8,810. Wow. Right here, Andre, no, no slide out on this side. There is one down there. That is a very nice armless awning with wind sensor. Nice frameless windows, beautiful full body paint job. And then right here is our side cameras, left side, right side, and the reverse side. And then right over here, Insignia TV on the outside. Put sound bar. Yes, ma'am. Look at the storage. And I'm so glad they did not take the Accolade handbook with the carpet, right? Right. Does the Accolade have the carpet or is that just the emblem? I don't I, know. I don't know. I think the Accolade does too. Doesn't matter. I think they all do that. With this the... one doesn't, which I love. Very nice aluminum slam latch doors. Uh-oh. Nice pass-through storage. Right here's our potable water. Potable water. Yes, ma'am. Coming on down here. More storage. Yes, ma'am. And if we can just get a look at that, the Pasadena. 
two one one two two in the house. <laughs> and then check this out: Onan eight thousand QD generator. Yeah. Very, very I quiet. I think generator. there's a quiet. Oh no, maybe not a propane quick connect. I thought it was with that tag hanging. No, out. I think it is. Oh yeah, it is. You are right, okay. Andrea. It's kind of silly how it's into yeah. the door, but it is what it is. More storage. Yes. And then coming around the back, Andrea, we do have a nice fiberglass rear cap. Andrea, this interesting. 15,000 pound hitch. Now I'm not saying you can tell 15,000 pounds. I got to talk to the people at Thor. I know the uh, accolades and Senecas can tow 12,000 pounds. Any more than 12,000 pounds, you must know before you tow. Uh, right there is the backup camera and there is a ladder to get up on the one piece TPO roof. Let's go up there and take a look. Okay, be careful, Matt. Here we go now. Hold on. Up here on the roof, you can see it's a nice one piece TPO roof. Not one, but two air conditioning units. I love that. Max Air fan covers there. Wine guard digital antenna and solar on the roof. Hold on. There we go. Two steps. Great. But, and if you haven't already subscribed, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Oh, Pasadena. Again, guys. Smash the thumbs up button. What an RV salesman from Pasadena is going to take his fat ass up on the roof, show you what features the roof has to offer. Nobody. Nobody. Finishing up, Andrea. Nice instant hot tankless water heater. Here's where we're dumping our tanks, okay? Well, our rear one. Black tank flush there. Here's going to be fuel fill. Right here's propane. Specs. Bing. Right there. Everybody who's watching on television. Oh, there it is again, Matt. What's Pasadena. that? Pasadena. There it is. And then right here is where you plug in your power cord. And then finishing up, what do we got here? We got the nice wet bay here. Very simple water purifier, outdoor shower. Yes. We got the other side of the storage here. Yes, ma'am. Other side of the storage. I do see the inverter in there. Yes. And a battery bank. Andrea, you know I love my Accolade XLs, but the Pasadena's giving it a run for the it money. It sure is. And then over here, Andrea, here's where you climb in, and that's where you uh, have more. That might snack. be, oh, we already did DEF, right? Right. Okay. No, DEF right there. That's right, it was on the other inception like that too. Well, Andrea, the outside of the Pasadena looks great, but the inside looks even better. Let's go, take a look. Okay. Oh, we already did the cargo. Yeah. It was like 8,000 something. 8,800. Wow. Okay. Let's Check see it out. what this one's like. Okay. Love these bunks. All right, coming in, as you can see, the slide is in. Wow, pretty spacious coming through here. You can definitely open the refrigerator. I walk through here. Opens up a lot more. We have our bathroom. And then the bed is a Telta bed, it looks like. And another bathroom there in the rear. Well, Andrea, while we're getting these slide outs out, let's give a huge shout out to our sponsor, RV Life. Wow. Just incredible how big it is. It's very nice, Andrea. Without further ado, we are starting in the cockpit area. Andrea. This is like a newly redesigned S2 RV chassis. Look at the seat. Air ride suspension, super comfortable. Right here, I can adjust my mirrors. Now, this is older looking, older looking dash, not the nice digital dash, but you know what? For some reason, when I'm in a super seat, I don't care about all the high tech fancy. I just want it to be American. Right here, we have the Allison transmission. Here's where we push our windows. Here's your parking brake right there. Your locks, your auto leveling, Sirius radio. Apple Card Play, Android also, auto, that's where your camera's gonna be. And Andrea. What's some, that up there? If somebody cuts you <laughs> off, you go like this. <laughs> Get out of my way. This is the Pasadena. I'm from Pasadena. <laughs> 21122. Two. And then Andrea, sit in my co captain seat. Oh. How does that feel? It feels very nice, actually. Yes. And every time I get one of these, you guys, I have to tell you how tempted I am just to drive off and go trucking. We're trucking. So, yeah, I, I think this is going to be a very nice ride. Of course, of course. Very nice uh, adjustable seats there and everything. We got the AC blasting. And then, Andrea, this one makes the Pasadena unique. This oversized bunk. So, let me do this. Let me do this, okay? 
You ready? Yes, Matt. Test ba it out. Bada bing, bada boom. Look, hey, 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 hey. Took his shoes off. Took, hey. Okay. Hey. America took my shoes off, okay? There is a ladder that goes there, everyone. Somewhere. But. Right. Posing windows, that's nice. And look, Matt is sitting up and he still has plenty of head space. Okay, so you see right here, Andrea? Do you see where that is? And then this is the way it should be. So, I should be sitting up like this. You know what I'm saying? But because of the bubble, I'm able to sit up properly. It's very nice. We have that right there. I mean, Andrea, I mean, even if you have a, like I think Will could sit up here and still be comfortable. You got your privacy, your blue lights and everything. And then Andrea, there is a button for this shade somewhere. And Didn't we is, have trouble finding it last yeah, time? Yeah, I think it was over here. Oh yeah, put it right and there. And then we do have a 800, it is 800 pounds. Oh yeah, 800 pounds. I don't know what that said, hold on. All right, Andrea, we will find the buttons. Here you go. All right, let me, uh, Matt's let getting me climb down. down. Let's go over here and check out this cabinet above the door. So you have some storage above the door. And then over here, I don't know if this is just for show. Let me see. Oh no, there's stuff in there. Okay, it's from this side. Okay, so you got another place to put things. And also down here, and as you can see down there, you got your uh, inverter control and another light pad, step lights, all that good stuff. Andrea, we will find where that windshield opens. But before we do, look at this huge window. Look at this. You have some Art Deco on the wall. Very nice looking valances. I don't like them very much. Sorry, denied. Womp, 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 womp. I Andrea. I don't know. They're not that bad. I just don't know. I don't like them. It's o hey, it's okay. Sorry. It, it's an opinion. Listen, they made an awesome motorhome. I think it, it looks so nice in here that they kind of, I mean, they're not horrible, but. Slow rise shades. MCD? Yes. Right here, Andrea. This dinette does drop down to make a bed. See all available features, scan that QR code. Drops down to make a bed. We also have cup holders here. Something else that I really like is this rear cushion. Andrea, I'm home. This is my seat. This is where I would be laying down or sitting just like this, being on my laptop right there, looking at the TV down there. It looks like we got some storage under there, Matt. We sure do. Okay, Little other drawer. side as well. You got I, another one? I do. Oh, I don't have any strength. I'm Aaron. sorry. Andrea, <laughs> not all heroes wear capes. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> Car seat tether. Look at the lights on. It's very cute. Yes. And then we do have the nice cabinetry. Nice matte gray look. Not gray. Matte brown look. Very nice. Ford does a great job with their cabinetry. Yes. We have speakers and USBs underneath there. Uh, power right there. And then here, here I am sitting on the sofa. That's a good size sofa. It is. It's nice. Me, Andrea, and the dog can sit here. Everybody else can fend for themselves. Very nice. Now, Andrea, this sofa is just a jackknife sofa. Okay. Let me show everybody. Bada bing, bada boom. That's pretty much it. Oh, look, there's a little cuppy back there. Yes. That's all she wrote. And then, ah, oh, here it is, Andrea. Oh, finally. I knew we would find it somewhere. What a weird place. We pushed this button not coming all the way up. It's okay. I can't figure it out right now, but it does go all the way up and it lets in natural light. And then directly across from the sofa, it's your TV entertainment center. Right here we have storage, insignia TV, sound system right there. And there is a fireplace that does produce heat from electricity. Well, Andrea, do you know what time it is? It's now time, time for, for the, the MSRP. MSRP. Burr, 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 burr. MSRP on this motorhome here is $353,535, Andrea. MSRP. I love that. It's 353535. Three, what a fantastic sale That's price. A good number. But Andrea, we all know nobody pays MSRP. So if you guys are interested in this motorhome, make sure you go to our website, mattsrvreviews.com, fill out the contact tab. Uh, we're going to make sure that we get you a great price, great service, and the best overall RV buying experience in the industry. Andrea, show us this kitchen. Okay, look at this. Talk I do to like me. these cabinets. It is new. We have a cabinet with adjustable shelf. Yes. Nice, good size window here. I believe we have a double sink. Yes, a double sink. All right. And then I did comment on this in the inside. 
exception. This is very interesting extension here. Yes. Haven't seen that style. It's more modern. And then we have storage underneath. Hey! That's a $156 trash can. What did I say, Matt? Thor seems to always put trash cans in there. Thor appreciates RVs. their customers more than others. Very nice solid surface countertops as well. Very pretty. We have four drawers. I don't, let me see if they're soft clothes. Oh, soft yeah. Soft clothes. Oh, yeah. We have a, uh, another cabinet above. Yes. Convection microwave. Very good. All right. So we have the two burner propane cooktop with the one burner induction. Okay. Got some cute backsplash. Another cabinet with adjustable shelves. Yes. And then a drawer down here. Very nice. Now, we have a residential refrigerator, LG. Oh, man. This is something that I don't really like. Uh-oh. Yeah, I don't want to go through this every time. But, see, look, like I'm already having a hard, hard time here. Okay, there we go. You got it? Andrea, we must see the fridge. We have to see the fridge. Very big deal. Okay. Good size. Residential runs off your inverter. And then we have the freezer here. Very nice. But yeah, this is a no-no. Okay, leave that like that. Oh, what is this? Is that a pantry? It sure is. Look Man, that. that's so nice. Now here's something I don't like about the pantry. It doesn't have the door. Well, no, it's like because you have the pantry, you're not able to get a stackable washer and dryer. Really? But Andrea, this huh. is the Pasadena. So this is prepped. It sure is. For a stackable washer and dryer. Prepped for it and it has adjustable shelves if you don't use it. Very and nice. And they got a drawer under here. Okay. All right. And, and Andrea, then... bath and a half. Let's take a look at it. All right, Matt. We got a nice medicine cabinet. Okay. Good sink. Nice little corner sink. Storage under the sink there. Oh, wow. Storage look here. at that. Yes, ma'am. Frosted window back there. Toilet on a pedestal. Hmm. Interesting. This is a prime poop position. Bing! And I promise you, it's not because it's the Pasadena look. I mean, this is very nice. I'm actually very surprised by this. I didn't think it was going to be because of the pedestal. Yeah. All right. Coming into the master, we have a pocket door. King size bed, tilt up bed. Not a fan of this. I uh, don't like the tilt up beds. Uh, we do have the windows on both sides. Nice art That's deco cute. right there. The balances are different in here. And Andrea, can I say something to America? Guys, big shout outs to rvmattress.com backslash Matt. Um, they're the reason why we're able to bring you the Matt's RV Reviews Europe edition. We have a whole video dedicated to rvmattress.com. If you guys need an RV, so many people just bought RVs over the past week. Make sure you use our promo code Matt and get yourself a mattress. Without RVMattress.com, we can never bring you Matt's RV Reviews Europe Edition. And we just appreciate them. Andrea, look at these balances. They're different in here. I freaking like them. Andrea? Denied. Wap, 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 wap. Double denial. Oh, maybe just, I should. Just, I don't know. Just don't, not my taste. Too much. I like it. I like it. You yeah, know what else I like? We seem to be on the same wavelength when it comes to decor. But so. you know what we are on the same wavelength with? The our, Pasadena. Our, no, our mattress from Brooklyn Bed. Yes. Right here we do have storage with your Insignia TV right there. Very nice storage. I guess they're not that bad. I love them. They just remind me of like, I don't know, older style. I love them. Right here we have power and USB. Wow, Six oh drawers. my gosh, Matt, hold on, back up. Hold up, wait a minute. Look at this. 12 drawers. Oh my goodness, that is crazy. Never seen that many drawers. Well, Andre, Good wardrobe. They know Pasadena women like this motor home, so they <laughs> need the drawers. All right. More storage there. Yep, and then USB on both sides of the bag. Okay. Andrea, wrap it on up in here. We got the pocket door going on to the uh, master bathroom here. Yep, nice shower, 24 by 36. You know, I expected a bigger shower for a bigger motorhome. Right. But at the same time, it's 24 by 36. It's minimum of what we're looking for, so it's pretty nice. Good walkway. All right, we got a medicine cabinet. Yes. More storage. Okay. Good size sink. Gave you some counter space in here. Storage under here. Looks like we have three drawers. Very nice. And then above, you have more storage. Wow. Wow. Very yeah. nice. Lots of storage. 
And then Andrea, we do have a porcelain hmm. toilet. I don't know. Neither do I. I don't like the wall here. Right. But Andrea, this is also a prime poop position. Bing! Matt, Very nice. I don't know if we've had eight peas the whole time we've been here. I think we did er an earlier on video. But Andrea, overall, it's an excellent motorhome with an excellent name at an excellent <laughs> price. Now, before everybody goes, it's time we give you three things we love about this motorhome, three things we don't love about this motorhome. Andrea, what do we do first? I'm gonna go with three things we dislike about it first. Okay, well the first one's a big one and it's outside. Andrea, dislike number one. This is absolutely crazy. I said this during the inception, I'm saying it again. Andrea, the 50 amp power cord, you have to plug into that. It's the dumbest thing I've ever seen. You have to plug our power cord into ours from the outside. Inside, it's even harder and with that 50 amp, how heavy it is, like you literally have to try to line it up and everything like this. I hate that, I hate that. I promise you, America, you will not see that on the part two Pasadena. That is the number one thing that I dislike about this so much. Andrea, that is dislike number one. Great, Andrea, that is dislike number one. Tell me dislike number two. Dislike number two, I gotta say. I was not happy with this pantry. Talk to me. I love, I, I like the space in it, but you know, I'm just a little let down because I really love their pull out drawers. It's okay, Andrea, they can add that. There's still time for them to change that. <laughs> that is dislike number two. And then Andrea, what's dislike number three? Dislike number three is I don't like the refrigerator when it doesn't have the locks. Yeah. I don't want to go through this every time. Um, and it's just much easier to lock and unlock. Yep. That's three, Andrea, short and sweet. That is three things we dislike about this motorhome. Now it's time for three things we love about this motorhome. Andrea, we're starting right up here. In the big oversized bunk over the cab, Andrea, an adult can actually sleep up here. It holds 800 pounds and the big old bubble makes it so they can sit up in there even if they do have a little bit of a longer torso. It works extremely well and I love that. That is like number one. Andrea, number two. Number two, I would just say the overall truck chassis. Hell yeah. The uh, SR2. Oh yeah. I mean, it just, it's nice, you know, and you're not like intimidated because it is shorter right there and you can see better. Andrea, <laughs> it's not nice. It's, it's awesome. It's bad. That's right. It's a bad boy. It's a Pasadena. Yes, ma'am. That's number two. And then Andrea, number three, I don't even know what to say. Um, you know, I love the dinette. I love the furniture. I love the whole layout of this motorhome. And truthfully, I don't mind the balances. I love the woodwork. I feel like this is a great, beautiful motorhome. And I feel like it's going to be disrupting the Jayco Seneca Accolade market because it is just that nice. Well, Andrea, that's it. That's the review. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys are interested in this motorhome, please go to mattsrvreviews.com. Fill out the contact tab. We're going to make sure that you guys get a great price great service and the best RV buying experience in the entire RV industry. Andrea, what do you want to say? Hey everyone, thank you so much for watching. Let us know the three things that you like about this RV and the three things that you dislike. Yes. Thor does read the comments and they do watch the videos. So especially on this one, you guys, Yes. please leave your feedback. Um, thanks, what, what are we saying? Thank you so much for the Hershey show, right? It's, it was great meeting we everybody. Had, yeah, we had a great time meeting everyone. And shout out to 21122. Shout out to Pasadena, Maryland. 21122. Thanks for watching, you guys. I hope you're safe and well. Thank you, absolutely, everybody, so much for watching. And Andrea, we'll see you next time.